Well, today in the Espresso Kitchen, we are making a classic sandwich, a good old tuna melt. Now, a tuna melt used to be one of my favorites as a youngster, so you can just imagine how excited that I was when I heard uh, Chef Moira is going to make it right here in the kitchen. But of course, as per usual, she's bringing her own little twist to it. Moira, lovely to see you again. Um, Thank you. I suppose yeah. you're going to call me the Twisted Chef. The Twisted <laughs> the Chef, if that's how you want to go by, it's all, it's all good. But um, <laughs> listen, a tuna melt, you know, firstly, let me ask you, what makes your tuna melt better than any other tuna melt? I think it's because, you know, over the years, everyone eats so much tuna when they're trying to diet and shed those kilos. And um, tuna and brown is so, so tasteless. <laughs> and so I thought, well, what can we do that will actually um, still be, you know, within the calorie limit um, that can actually taste nice? Okay. Um, so with, with our pickles, we've, you know, we've got these pickled cucumbers, dill cucumbers and um, the ku... Um, pickled onions and we're using that again because the little onions have got the sweetness coming through and that crunch So yeah. you don't want to just eat a, a, a mushy sandwich. So okay. you want some texture right. in it Well, just by adding those two already I can tell it's gonna be better than you know, not so boring Correct. as usual, right? Do you want to get going? Yeah, why not? All right, are you gonna stir for me? <laughs> oh, absolutely. All right, so um, we're gonna add in um, our pickled cucumbers. All right. All right, let's just add all of those. Here you go. I've, I've just diced them because obviously you don't want a whole big piece in Yeah. yeah. All right. All right. So we've added that in. So, and then we're going to add, I've done a little bit of a spin off, you know, because fish goes well with honey and mustard. Yes. Um, so I'm putting in a little bit of whole grain mustard. All right. Um, some honey. Ah, there we go. I like it. And this just balances out the, the, the acidity from the onions some and honey, the pickled cucumbers. Eh? And um, it's just a, a natural way. It's, it's more healthy way than adding in sugar there or chutney go. or something like that. And then we add in a burger mayonnaise. Now, a lot of people just use a burger mayonnaise for burgers. I like to put it into different things because there's a lot of flavor in it. Yes. And we're not going to make it soggy because you still want to have the texture of the fish and you don't want to add all those calories in. All right. So you just add just enough. Just a bit of a taste. Just a little bit of a taste. All right. Um, and then we're going to add in a little bit of um, flat um, leaf parsley just to give it some colour. Right. You could add some spring onions into it if you want to. But okay. I think there's enough um, in there. It's supposed to be a yeah. quick and easy dish. Add a little bit of salt because the, the tuna is quite bland. That's it. And then I like lots of black pepper. Black pepper and tuna should always go together. Correct. There you go. So you can see that's your mixture already done. All right. So we're going to put it onto some low GI bread. I've just toasted some. You don't need to put any butter in because you're trying to keep it as healthy as possible. All right. Um, and then we're going to top it with some mozzarella cheese slices just um, just to and mozzarella is obviously less fat than cheddar yes. the yellow cheeses and then we're going to melt it in the oven it's going to be delicious now if you want to get your hands on a, a beautiful tuna melt sandwich this morning with the difference though that keyword is ku sms that to 33728 that's 33728 and you'll uh, automatically be entered into the draw to win yourself a gourmet amc pan worth 2000 400 rand. Brilliant, brilliant prize that we're giving away this morning. And um, yeah, you can make this. It's a nice little snack, I think, you know, for the, for even, even for an well, early dinner. Correct. And also yeah. for kids that come home so hungry. And what do they first look for? They first look for chips or That's biscuits it. or sweets in the cupboard. <laughs> and this is such, for those home moms, this is so, so nice for the kids. And you're getting in that nutrition from the tuna. Um, and obviously the pickled onions um, yeah. will make it really tasty. And they won't even know what's gone into it. I like it. Right. Well, you so want to pop that in the oven? oven? While well, she pops in the oven for us, uh, remember the keyword once again, ku, SMS that to 3 Three seven two eight. We'll send you the recipe. Also, a link to the recipe that you can go check out, and you'll automatically be entered into the draw to win yourself a gourmet AMC pan worth two thousand four hundred rand. But uh, here's one last look at how we made it. Mixed tuna, ku cocktail onions, cucumbers, honey, mustard, mayonnaise, and seasoning. Place onto bread. Top with cheese. Then place into the oven until cheese is melted. For the full recipe, visit the Expresso Morning Show Facebook page or log on to www.expressoshow.com SMS the keyword KU to 33728 to receive the shopping list on your phone. Click on the link provided to view the recipe. SMSs cost 1 Rand 50. No free SMSs. T's and C's apply. And in no time, you have yourself a gourmet tuna, tuna melt sandwich. That keyword is KU. SMS that to 33728. And we'll send you everything you need to know to make these beautiful sandwiches. Look at that. Coming out the oven, all sizzling and hot and beautiful. Looks decadent, doesn't this, it? <laughs> this is a tuna melt with a difference, let me tell you. Obviously, just um, if your kids are helping you make this, they must be careful of the hot tray. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to plate it up with some lovely um, chickpeas, the okay. chickpeas, because it's not a nutty and it makes it a real wholesome meal. And this yeah. is really, if you're wanting a light meal, if 
if you're wanting to um, make it more than just a snack. All right. And then I'm putting on some lovely beetroot. I find it um, very healthy and it adds some colour and it also adds some crunch and it goes yeah. really well with the tuna. So you just add a little bit on enough for a portion we and then we're going to plate that up. Where do, I, where do I put it? Put one down then, we'll put another one on the top. Like there? Correct. That's lovely. Okay. And, and then one the other one on the, on the like other so. side. Correct. Uh, there, I'm going to let you do it because... I'll take you know, it from you. There we go. <laughs> careful, it's hot. Ah, there we go. And then we'll just garnish it with a little bit of flat leaf parsley. Oh, and how yes. beautiful is that? Look at that, Chef Moira. There we go. Thank you so much for sharing your tuna melt recipe with us. Eh? My pleasure. Thank Brilliant. you for having Brilliant. me. Yeah, always lovely to have you. Remember that keyword to make your gourmet tuna melt recipe like Chef Moira just did. It's Mr. Keyword Q to 33728. That's Q to 33728. We'll send you everything you need to know. Keep in mind those SMSs do cost one round fifty, but you'll automatically be entered into the draw to win yourself a gourmet AMC pan worth 2,400 Rand. And also, if you feel like sharing, share some of your recipes with us using canned products. And uh, we could be making them live here on the show with Chef Moira. The uh, email address, you can send them to food at expressoshow.com. That's food at expressoshow.com. Send those recipes. Come on, we want to know. Only the best cooks serve Koo because they know it's carefully grown and made with meticulous attention. So when you serve Koo, you can trust you serving only the best.